right, back to the race action. Bring it up to uh, Dave here, Scotty. We've got uh, Jager Jones we were just talking about. And here comes Haley Deegan. And definitely, you're right, much faster on the track than Jace Jones. And she's making up some time. We don't know if she's got enough. We've got about uh, maybe 10 laps to go. Well, she's cut into the lead. Now it's down to a 2.9 second lead. So she's cut uh, almost a couple of seconds off of that lead. And I'm just, uh, I just, both drivers, you can see them working this track. Haley finally got this car hooked up on this second run. Now, of course, these, uh, these uh, drivers have radios, so I'm sure that their uh, crew chiefs are keeping them uh, up to date on where they are and uh, what kind of lead uh, Jagger has and things like that. Well, Jagger right now is coming up on about five lapped cars. So right here he's got to work on these cars coming out of turn two. George, lap traffic has played a part in both races tonight. Oh, I know. Will it have an effect on this race too? And you know, the problem is we got to hope the driver gets out of that lane because look, you see that right there, that driver blocking Jager Jones coming out of four because he just wants to stay down the bottom. The spotter should be saying, hey, leader's coming, get out of the way. Yeah, but uh, a lot of these inexperienced drivers, they don't know how to get off the bottom. They really don't. Jagger really having trouble lapping that car, and Haley Deegan catching up. Well, that's going to get Deegan a lot closer to the leader. And now, she's, right now, she's only about five, six car lengths back from Jagger Jones, and she's got to work on this same driver See if the driver can get out of the way. A lot of it's going to come down to timing now. And she does. She makes a nice pass there on the, on the lap car. So she didn't lose nearly as much time as Jagger Jones. And now she's about four or five car lengths behind Jagger Jones and moving up. The fastest lap right now. Four laps to go, right? Yeah, four laps to go. And uh, Jagger Jones still in lap traffic. Haley Deegan really catching up now in turn three and four. And could this be another main event down to the last lap? Only three laps remaining. We got a car going really slow on the bottom in front of the leaders going down the back straightaway as the leaders come up. That... Uh, might have helped Haley. She's now within a car and a half, two cars back for Haley Deegan. You know she's real big in that rearview mirror right now. And look at all that traffic ahead, George. There's all kinds of traffic for this leader to get through. Yeah, and with everybody staying down on the bottom of the track, Jager tries to get by. He gets by. And Haley right there in tow. She's going to follow Jager right around. White flag is out. And Jager gets chopped off by this car. He doesn't have room to go. This is it. And look at Haley, Haley Deegan, Deegan into the move underneath. three coming out of turn two. That yes. is crazy. Three, this is down to the last turn once again. All right, a chrome horn there, chrome horn, but Haley Deegan is gonna win the race. Third race tonight with the last lap pass. Give it up for the young lady out of Temecula, California. George, what are the chances of that? Three out of three last lap passes for the win tonight. She made statements early on in the week that she didn't want second. She wanted first place. She was coming to Vegas to win this race. George, when I had to interview her in September, there were uh, tears in her eyes when that race was over because she knew she had been fast all week and man alive, she was able to make the pass for the win tonight. So uh, right now, Haley Deegan, Jager Jones, and Joey Tanner, your top three, are gonna pull up down there. We're gonna get an interview with all three drivers. Tough break for Derek Kraus. Austin Reed in the 14 car. Definitely uh, the car to beat 
coming out in the main event, but uh, definitely things change in the main event. So Haley Deegan, last year she finished second behind Sheldon Creed doing some donuts down there. She left this race going and winning the next K&N Pro Series West race in Meridian, Idaho. Give it up for the woman, second time to win a race in the K&N Series for a woman. This has never been done. Believe me, she is pumped. She came to this race, saw the statements she made. She came here to win. She didn't want second like she got last year. She is the dirt princess. Las Vegas, let's give it up for Haley Deegan. Temecula, California. We're gonna send it down to uh, my partner, Scotty, and do an interview with these winners. Give it up for Pit Boss. Pit Boss is gonna be very busy this week over at the big track. All right, George, I'm down here in the winner's circle, the K&N Victory Lane. Haley Deegan is in her car. <laughs> We're waiting for her to get out. 